My first time running in months. Are you ready? Let's do it. I'm excited. So we're gonna do a couple of different workouts to get our baseline aerobic capacity. Definitely gonna be doing some other drills, which leads me on my next thing is I'm done lifting weights. Really? I'm, I'm done with it uh, for right now. I can still do some strength conditioning with weights, but I'm not gonna be doing my, you know, five sets of five or my three by two by one by one or anything like that. Who's getting knocked out right now? Hold on one sec. I got the fights on. It's Holloway versus Cater in like an hour and we're going to the track, so I gotta pause them. Go boys! Woo! That's some big ass boys. So anyways, I just got done with a heavy lifting phase. Um, my numbers are super high right now too. I put on like 50 pounds on my incline press. I seated press about 40 pounds. This is the strongest I've ever been on my upper body. And then I, I just added my sumo deadlift back into my workout. Like I want to say like two weeks ago and it was only 305s, nothing, nowhere near my max, but it felt easy even with the knee. So um, we're going to change the focus. I feel like Goku when he gets different masters. So I had Uncle Joe and that was kind of like the Kami training, like our Master Roshi training. I mean, like the turtle hermit training, like just overtrain and then hit walls and keep pushing. And then now, I feel like I have, I'm, I'm up in Kami's lookout with Mr. Popo and Kami. It's funny. <laughs> I'm like hardcore, hardcore into that mindset right now. I hope he's a little anime head like me, but yeah. All right, we're gonna go track, get this done. Oh, he's pissed. Sorry, baby. I'm sorry. I played fetch me this morning. We'll take, she's coming anyways. My dog does what she wants. Ali, come on, you gotta come back inside. You gotta come back inside. Let me get her treat. Okay. Welcome to Las Vegas, Nevada, where tracks are locked up because it is trespassing to come work out when school's not in session. But I went here, so I think I'm good. It's windy. You good? Don't tear your pants. You want me here? Use your fascia. There we go. I noticed from doing the hyper arc training is I have a spring in my step so I really feel like I'm not exerting as much it's weird like 
I feel like my arcs are tighter in my feet. They're stronger, and so I just feel like I have springs almost. So the difference between you and your like favorite athlete, even if you guys can both squat 405, you can deadlift 500 pounds. Why can he jump so much higher than you? Why is he more athletic? Why can he shift weight? And a lot of it could be due with like the myelin and the cell for muscle memory, but also like his fascial connection is gonna be better. So his tensioning and how he can move with his tensioning in the fascia is gonna be better. And it's all gonna come from connections from the feet to the glute to the abs and everything like that. So that's my understanding of it. I'm just a rookie, I'm a little amateur with fascia. From what the coach is saying is he's impressed with how athletic and how like I'm winning fights basically. Um, but so far, good results. At the end of the day though, I do feel like this will make me better. And uh, we'll see how far I can get in just uh, in four minutes, I'm assuming, I mean, more than two laps. meters in four minutes not the best I would have smoked me on the track from the day I tore my knee until now think about that you can stay in shape even if you're injured it's just up here don't listen to your excuses Michael try to catch me on the we hit one lap we're going to I hear fucking I hear push-ups I was like oh shit I looked down we're only a minute 30 in and he started slowing I was like it was like fasting Fast and Paris. Too soon, Junior? Yeah. Hit the knot. <laughs> Let's go! Good shit. Recover, recover. We'll go again. We go again. And again. And again. How many meters did I do? Um, or how many? About a thousand meters. So in four in four minutes. How, what is that? That's two and a half laps. And four laps is a mile? Yeah. So you're like seven, eight minute mile pace. Yeah. Yeah. That's not bad though. Dude, he caught me over there. I was like, what the no, fuck? I know, and then I blew my load. I felt I know, it. I know. I was like, oh, this is bad for you. But then I fucked up because I saw you. It was 1.30 and he caught me. I was like, we only got 30 seconds left. Go. I was like, wait, we're doing four minutes, idiot. Yeah. So I was like, what? I just said, fuck it. I just kept going with the pace. And I was like, if I get tired, I get tired. But it was good. Dude, she took off. Holy shit. All right, we have Clarissa Conji here. She just finished a 100 meter gazelle sprint. She's in the lead now. She's catching her breath on the curve and she's gonna bring it home on this straightaway right here. You hear it here first, Clarissa Conji in first place. Let's see how she does. Clarissa Conji, final 100 meter sprint. Her teammates say she's in top form for this. She cut no corners for today's track session. Here she comes around the bend. She's holding her side like she has a cramp. Will this affect her final time? Here we go. She's starting on the straight. Slow pickup, arms wide. She is fatigued. Oh, she's picking up speed. She's coming in right now. She's on world record pace. She's on world record pace. Here she comes in, bringing it home. Across the finish line, she finishes first place. It's Clarissa Conji. Woo! Let's see this right here. Oh my gosh, the blood is all in her bum. Her trainer comes in to celebrate. The fastest 100 meter walk, 100 meter sprint. How do you feel? Very good, Clarissa Conji, she's lost for words. She's just in shock. You no, know, I think she's speechless right now. We've trained very long, very hard. There's been, you know, a lot underneath Thank the you, surface. Michael Sheedy, this is Clarissa Conji. <laughs> yeah, the sprint over there was solid. Dude, we were like, what the fuck is, I couldn't get the camera out fast enough. You are the, I've never seen anything so fast in my life. I swear to God you're booking it. I'm actually proud. You haven't ran with me in like months. <laughs> Your elbows are a little wide. We'll fix that. Imagine when you don't do that yet. Honestly, Loki, when you're running, you're like this. I, I run in a straight line, yeah. My numb toe is not helping things. Yeah. I think I'm gonna hit a. I think I'm gonna hit the two minute one now. Okay. I might. We got this. I'm gonna go up here.
seconds so I crossed the finish line it was at 20 or not 21 so somewhere in 10 seconds it's good I used to be slow so yeah. Michael says his calves are pumped oh I had to zoom like five times to see him <laughs> jokes quadzilla though when I grow up I want to look like you good luck <laughs> mine too yeah how's that we're gonna stretch, get some, a little more work out. We'll do some clap push-ups and shit. If you ever have lower back pain, right here is the stretch. You're gonna hit a bit of the psoas, but you're gonna hit your adductors, your abductors, everything like that. Release the quads. There we go. Lean back more, Michael. Lean back more. Like the Titanic pose. Arms out. Here, I'll get behind you and spot you. Is Riz doing another sprint? Yeah. Not a girl. I did, uh, I changed my YouTube name to what? Only Vance. I love that. Only Vance. I love that. I'm gonna make the Only Vance logo. start posting more. Oh, yeah. Good shit, babe. So I don't know what, what, what happened, but I have this weird thing going on with my knee, and it's, uh, like, I got a bug bite, and then it multiplied. Did you see it? Did you see uh -uh. it? See it? Oh, it's fucking swollen, yeah? It's from the ground. <laughs> oh, that? Oh. <laughs> no, it's red, so I was like, I knew it was the no, ground. Look, she goes, she goes, the world is my oyster. I said, can you be my oyster? Oh. Yeah, it's like. Yeah, but I thought they were. <laughs> <No>. the, <laughs> fucking gingers, dude. They just, they, they ruin you. Is this a workout vlog or a submission for Vans only? This is only Vans. This is the only Vans. Is it Fans only or only Fans? Only fans. So it's only Vance, yeah. This is premium content. What the? Wow. Ah. Don't go fucking run again. Tighten it up. Wow, dude. I should feel so loose right now. We are working out for a lot. You get a foam roll. You have to put your fascia that pitch, right? Use a tennis ball. Lacrosse ball's too hard. Because your fascia has more sensory nerves. Ten times more sensory nerves than your muscles, right? You have a muscle, and you're like, oh, you need to dig in and push lactic and all that. Like, yeah, you use a foam roll. It's big surface area, you need to push it. But for fascia, like on your foot, you're gonna want to heal the toe. Just moderate pressure for two minutes. Too hard, and your body's gonna, your fascia's gonna have like a defense mechanism. It's gonna tighten up because it has in, like something with high pressure per square inch digging into your, your skin, you know? So your fascia will tighten too little, you're not gonna get benefits, so you just want a good moderate roll. You have fascial adhesions from your toes to your glutes, you're gonna have impacted performance, you're gonna have limited mobility the whole night. Apparently you're faster than me and you're shorter than me. Well, <laughs> I can feel more adhesions. That's what's crazy, and that's the difference between me being strong and being on squat, but me being athletic, you know? And being on drive and sprint, fucking boom, transfer energy from the floor to the chin. So instead of just like being normal, like careless about my feet and just being comfortable, I was like really engaged in the hyper arc, right? And I noticed like, normally I'm like, one, two, two, like one, two, some two, but when I engage in the hyper arc, it's like, boom, like, quicker, faster, reactive. Right, boom. getting back I, to connecting with the floor. Yeah, and I, I'm always fast, yeah. like left to right, like fast like this, but I was super fast, like same side, like literally, like, boom, boom. Like being able to plant, throw, 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 like the same side. Yeah. Using the muscles in the feet. Yes. Using the fascia. Yeah. Not the muscles, the fascia. The workout's over at Focus. Hello. Okay. So your next fight, you're going to get a knockout. 100%. Let's go. Not a TKO, a KO. Well, if a ref's opinion right. to save a, a man, yeah. stop it. TKO, yeah. Maybe I'll just TKO him. Yeah. Yo, Clark County School District, I'm serious. 
let us work out. Quit trying to lock us out of the track on weekends. Let us better ourselves. If you guys got a got an issue with it, you guys send your deadliest warrior, and me and him can do combat, and we can see who wins, and then winner gets to make the rules. Fuck you, Clark County. Let's go. We're gonna grab. We're gonna grab a coffee break. Oh, look at the tropical smoothie cafe. I don't like that shit, honestly, but... It's anyways. probably all bad, but it's delicious. Pro tip, caffeine increases carb absorption up to four times. You have different transporters to get carbs to your muscle cells post-workout, and like salt and caffeine both uh, can increase carb absorption back in the muscle. Harder. So nice out right now. I don't want to go back home. <laughs> I want to stay outside all day. I post on Instagram where I got a bomba, bomba, which is Brazilian for steroids. Bitch, I'm on anime and nutrition. Starbs. She knows. She's like, give me the fucking puppuccino. Nobody gets hurt. Thank you. I just smashed on the door like a dummy. You don't want that? What are you doing? <laughs> you don't want it? No? Ali. She don't even give a shit about it. We got smashed on the door like a... You don't want this? Are you dieting? What the fuck? Oh, and mom gives it to you? Oh my gosh. Okay, I know. Spilt it everywhere. I'm so Oh my a god. Dummy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What the hell, dude? She don't want to eat it from me. That's um, rude. Well, good thing we're going to car wash. Dude, we can't take her sweater off either. If you take her sweater off, she gets mad. I swear she pouts. She'll sit in the corner and she gives you that side eye. Right on. This for you. Appreciate that. No worries. Thank you so much. No, that one's mom's. That one's mom's. Woo! Yeah, she had a unicorn uh, onesie that we put on her and we took it off one day. We were like, all right, she's probably sick of it. She was like, sitting in the corner pouting. I was like, why are you upset right now? What the hell? We put it back on. She's fucking wagging her tail back to normal, all happy. Took it off again. She got so mad, so. Now she's got a, where is it? Now she's got a red sweater from Christmas. You ready for the car wash? <laughs> she doesn't like it. Holly, come here. Yeah. Oh no, this is a bad idea. You're the greatest. You float like a butterfly and sing like a bee. The greatest puppy dog the world's ever seen. You have no fear. Almost perfect timing, but Matt Brown versus Condit. I'm a little red, actually, but I just want to sit outside, so just chill outside, watch this fight, and then we got to get ready. We got a dinner day at catch tonight, so I'm stoked. No more waits for 12 weeks. I'll keep you guys updated. I have, like, a whole documentary, almost, of, like, that's probably where I'll keep most of my fascia updates is on that. I have, like, a big, uh, I have the day I tore my knee on video. So we got that video going. We got wrist turning on the sink while I'm vlogging. That's great. Um, I think I'm gonna get a microphone for this, like a little cheapy, just so the video quality, I mean the audio is better. And pump out content and just let you guys see what I'm doing. I'm a natural athlete, so there's proof of concept, everything I'm doing, obviously like it's working because I get accused of being on steroids nonstop, just like today. So one, hopefully I can inspire you, I can give you knowledge or I can give you entertainment. One of, one of the three, or all three, so.